Hello everyone at Financial Fitness Hub. Today, we're going on a super exciting journey to learn about money. We're going to explore eight amazing rules that will help you become a money wizard. Get comfy, grab your favorite snack, because today, we dive deeper into each one and uncover more secrets to becoming financially free. Ready for more? Let's go. First, let's talk about how some people get really rich, really fast. Take Jay Walker, for example. He made a website called Priceline.com and became a billionaire in just a year. But fast money can be like a roller coaster. It goes up and down super fast. That's why understanding money is so important. Rule one, money grows like trees. Believe it or not, money can grow just like trees do. I know it sounds funny because we've all heard that money doesn't actually grow on trees. But here's the secret. When you save money or make smart investments, it's like planting a seed. Just like a seed needs time to grow into a big tree, your money needs time to grow too. If you're patient and make good choices, your little seed of money can grow into a big, strong tree of wealth. We talked about how money can grow like trees. Now let's dig a bit deeper. Think about the richest people you know or have heard of. Many of them didn't get rich overnight. They saved a bit of their money, invested it in different things like stocks, businesses, or property, and waited patiently. This is like planting different types of seeds in your garden, each growing at its own pace. Some investments grow quickly, while others take time. The key is to be patient, care for your investments, and watch as they grow bigger and stronger over time, just like a forest of money trees. Rule two, be careful with spending. Now, rule two is all about being careful with your spending. It's so easy to want to buy all the cool stuff we see. But if we spend all our money, we won't have any left for saving or investing. Think of it like this. If you have a big jar of cookies and you eat them all at once, you'll have no cookies left for later. So, it's really important to think about how much you're spending. Try to save some money, just like you would save some cookies for another day. Let's talk more about being careful with spending. It's not just about not buying things. It's about spending money wisely. Imagine you have a certain amount of money each month. Think of it as your money pie. You don't want to use up the whole pie at once. Instead, you should divide it. Some of it should go to things you need, like food and clothes. Then, you should save a slice for later, maybe for something big like a bike or a trip. And don't forget to put a slice aside for your future. That's your saving and investing slice. Being smart with spending means enjoying your money today while saving for tomorrow. Rule three, money is a lifetime game. Moving on to rule three, money is a game that lasts your whole life. It's not just about making money, but also about keeping it and making it grow. Imagine having a garden. You can't just plant seeds and forget about them. You need to water them, take care of them, and give them sunlight. It's the same with money. You have to take care of it, make good choices, and always think about how to make it grow, even when you're older. Money being a lifelong game means you're always learning and adapting. As you grow older, your money needs and goals will change. When you're young, you might save for toys or games. As a teenager, maybe for college or a car. And as an adult, for a house or your own family's needs. Throughout all these stages, the way you handle money will evolve. You'll learn new ways to save, different things to invest in, and how to make smarter choices. It's a never-ending game, but it gets more exciting and rewarding as you learn and grow. Rule four, money and happiness. Rule four is really important. Money doesn't solve all problems. Sometimes we think buying expensive stuff will make us happy or popular, but happiness doesn't come from things. It comes from being happy with who you are. True happiness is about feeling good inside, about who you are, and not just about what you own. Sure, new things are exciting, but that excitement fades. What lasts is the joy from doing things you love, like playing with friends, spending time with family, or learning new skills. Remember, no amount of money can buy true friends, love, or happiness. Those come from being kind, generous, and true to yourself. Rule five, keep your wealth secret rule. Number five is about keeping your money secret. It's exciting to share good news, but when it comes to money, it's better to keep quiet about it. If everyone knows you have a lot of money, they might treat you differently. Keeping your wealth a secret might sound strange, but it's pretty wise. 
Imagine you found a treasure chest. If you tell everyone about it, they might want to share, or worse, try to take it from you. Keeping quiet about your money keeps you safe from people who might want to use you for it. It also helps you stay humble and focused on what's truly important, not just showing off, but using your money to make your life and others' lives better. Rule six, opportunities in tough times. Sixth rule, tough times can be the best times to grow your money. It's like being a superhero who gets stronger with every challenge. When the economy is struggling, it's actually a good chance to save and invest. These tough times can be like finding a hidden gem that everyone else missed. Tough times can be surprising opportunities to grow your money. It's like a game where you find hidden treasures in unlikely places. When the economy is down, prices of things like stocks or houses might go down too. That can be a good time to buy them when they're cheaper. Then, when things get better, their value goes up, and so does your money. It's about being brave and smart, looking for chances to grow your wealth, even when things seem tough. Rule 7. Expenses grow as you do. Rule 7. As you get older, you'll probably spend more. Life is like a video game. As you level up, things get harder, and you might need more stuff. As you grow up, you might need things like a car or a house. It's true that you'll probably spend more when you get older, but that's not a bad thing. It's like leveling up in life. Each new level, going to high school, then college, then maybe starting a family, brings new adventures and also new expenses. That's why learning to manage your money now is so important. It prepares you for all those exciting future stages so you can enjoy them without worrying too much about money. Rule eight, wealth takes time. Last but not least, rule eight, building wealth takes time. It's like learning to play a sport or an instrument. You don't become awesome at it overnight. You have to practice, learn, and keep trying. Saving and investing money is just like that. Start with a small amount, be patient, and slowly but surely, your money will grow. Think about the first time you tried to ride a bike. You probably didn't get it right away. It took practice, maybe some falls, and patience. Saving and investing money is just like that. But that's what makes it so rewarding. You start small, learn as you go, celebrate your small wins. Each time you save a bit more or make a smart spending choice, give yourself a pat on the back. These small victories add up and keep you motivated. And remember, everyone's financial journey is different. Don't compare yourself to others. Focus on your own goals and progress. With patience and persistence, you'll see your wealth grow over time. And that's it, my friends. You've now got a deeper understanding of these eight money rules. Keep these tips in mind and you're sure to do great with your money. Thanks for sticking with us at Financial Fitness Hub. Come back for more fun and helpful advice. Remember, being smart with money is a journey, and we're here to help you every step of the way. See you next time and keep building your treasure. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and share your own money tips in the comments. We're all on this journey together, so let's help each other. Thank you for watching.